what's up guys this is clutch number 20 and uh, as you can see um, this is a GHI bot butter possible hair albino to an albino and I did pair uh, we did pair her to a uh, visual albino too um, but from the looks of it we got pippers already and it does not look like we've got albinos so that means the albino did inside the clutch so it could be dual sire clutch who knows but i'm just hoping to prove out this uh, ghi butter to be albino so i'm excited and uh really want to get this cut so let's go ahead and uh get to cutting this clutch <music> So, we've got three pippers already, and uh, this one was out, the head was out, and it was not albino. So, um, we shall see. Uh, all right, let me uh, let's start with this one at the edge. Whoops. Come on, little buddy. There you go. So let's go start with this one and see what we have. Uh, oh, it's dark. So it's not an albino. But it looks like it's a GHI. Now the good thing is I know these guys are 100% albino because it was paired to a visual so Everything that is in this clutch will be a visual, I mean not a visual, a 100% head for albino. So this one's pretty plump. It's probably going to gush out once I nip it. Boom. Yep. Oh, it's looking light. Now trick me uh, that one's a lesser 100% head for albino so it's already starting to scratch at its shell I can tell the head's already peeking out or at least at the top and uh, trying to scratch up oh, this one has actually got some cuts already so this was bound to come out already all right, this one's looking dark also. Uh, this one looks like a normal hit. So they're going to be tight in here. 12 eggs, I believe. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, 12. 12 eggs. Last year she gave us 8, and this year it's 12. So it looks like my male did. That's probably not going to. Uh, well, it's too early to tell. So that one is another GHI. That's look a pretty a nice looking GHI. Very dark. Alright. This one right here, corner, I think looks like a GHI lesser. Or GHI butter, I should say. It's pretty uh, purple. So let's see. Oh. Looks like a normal. And uh, let's see. Come on. So, so far, we have like uh, one GHI here, two GHI. And I mean, until I cut that one, I'll confirm that that's a GHI, that one on the bottom left. GHI butter. And that one is a nice GHI butter, 100% hep for albino. All right, oh, yeah. look at that, we got a gusher. All right, so. This one's a normal. And it 
looks like we do not have a hit albino so oh well that's okay Ooh, that's a lesser. That's a different, very different looking lesser. So, could be from the head. Last one. And we have, uh, looks like another lesser. Yeah, that looks like another lesser. Very low. I mean, I'm sorry. I keep saying lesser. Um, the line was butter, but you know, to be honest, if you ask me, butter and lesser are really the same. So, um, you know, depending on who you ask, they're kind of interchangeable. But at, for the sake of uh, keeping the lines, I'm gonna call it butter. That's another butter right there, and that particular butter actually has another clutch that will be hatching um, probably sometime this week, uh, end of the week. Um, that one I'm excited for. And I think this one right here is another, there we go. Yeah. GHI butter, I mean GHI, yeah, GHI butter. Yeah, I was right. See that? So, GHI butter, 100% hep for albino. And then this one, let's go ahead and cut this guy. I think this one's a normal, not a normal GHI. Oh, that's a normal. So these are all 100% hit. So from the looks of it, we have two GHI butters, two GHIs, and one, two, three, four butters. Not bad. And then this is the other GHI butter. So two of those. So there you go. I'm gonna go ahead and leave them alone. They're probably gonna be start crawling out here in the next couple of days, uh, probably tomorrow, especially the ones that have already pipped. So let me go ahead and um, uh, cut the cut the video here, and then we'll return once they're all out. So. so here we go. <clears throat> Looks like I've. Uh... I've already uh, rinsed them all off, and let's see, move this to the side a little bit. So I've rinsed them off and uh, cleaned them up a little bit, and then I'm gonna go ahead and split them up in the. Actually, there's 12 of them, so I'm gonna go ahead and split them up in two tubs. Um, that way, they're not too crammed in there. Um, so six and six, so maybe I'll do it like all males, all females, we'll see. Uh, but I'll go ahead and split them up so that way uh, nothing can get really trampled on or get uh, squeezed in the bottom and can't get any air. So I want to make sure that they, they have the best chance for survival. <clears throat> so this, um, it, this, this clutch is a little bit male heavy again. So let's go ahead and uh, get started with the normals. Um, so a bunch of normals here, and these are all 100% hit for uh, albino. And so we got one female normal, and these are some pretty normals. And then another female normal, and this one is a. Oh, another female normal. Oh, so we got some escapee. And then let's check this one out. Oh, another female normal. Let me uh, make sure that one doesn't get out. 
and then I believe that's all the normals. So the rest, um, let's go check out what, what we have the rest here. Uh, let's go with this one. So this one is a pretty lesser. There you go. I saw one here with a ringer. So I'm going to show you guys that. So this one, let's go check. Oh, so we finally got a male. Male lesser there. And then let's go ahead and check this one out. Actually, I'm sorry, it's not lesser, it's a butter. This, that's the line. Oh, another male. So all the majority of these are gonna be available. Um, I was really just trying to, I, I bred this clutch so I could prove out my male. And 12 eggs, no albinos, is almost uh, uh, positive that there is no albino in, in him, so or het albino, I, said, I should say. So this is a, another pretty pretty butter right here. Look at that. And let's go double check. Okay, female. So far, two males uh, on the lesser. And then this one, I believe, is the one with the ringer. And I believe this one was male. I already, I already, um, uh, checked on this guy because I saw the ringer. It's like wow, that's nice And let's go double check. Yeah, that's a male. So I didn't even have to try hard popping him Okay, all right, and I've already checked all four of these are males. So um, Out of 12 eggs. We have two GHI le uh, GHI butters two GHI's all of them are males and then three, three butter males and then one butter female. So, but all the normals are females. I wish it was the other way around. But, you know, you win some, you lose some. Uh, it's just, that's just the odds. But these, uh, these guys are pretty, pretty wicked looking. Um, now that I, I'm seeing, um, it could be just, how um eh. I mean very similar coloration actually these guys are a little bit more when they hatch uh, more silver but uh, the other one uh, the dad to this uh, which uh, which I produced actually came out a little bit more more brown so I, I'm, I will have to do a comparison um, and you know these these guys will change colors as as they um, they shed so let me go ahead and actually put these guys let me uh okay so there you go this is the entire clutch lots of eggs um, I know a few of you guys are already interested in the GHI butter. Um, one of my friends is actually going to go ahead and keep the G, uh, one of the GHI butters. Uh, and these are all 100% het or albino. So this one, I the genetics, I don't have to guess because the female is a an albino. So I can't, it, everything's going to be 100% het albino. <clears throat> so... The GHIs are going to be available. Um, we're going to be keeping one GHI butter, and the G, one of the GHI butters is, is actually, I believe, it's this one um, that uh, actually someone already spoken for, and this one we're going to end up keeping, and then the rest will be available. Um, so, if you guys want to be on the list uh, that are interested in in uh, picking one up. Let me know. Just comment below or message me on Instagram, Facebook, or text message me, and uh, we can uh, we can you know put you on a list as far as uh, people that are going to be. Uh, I'm assuming you're going to want one. Most likely, you guys are going to want the GHI GHI combo. So uh, <clears throat> and maybe the lesser. So just let me know which one you guys are interested in. I'll put you guys on that list. But um, yeah, this is it.
and the next video I'm going to be showing uh, will be the, the post post shed uh, videos so just kind of so everyone can really see what they look like the colors uh, and maybe I'll shoot the video outdoors with natural lighting you know we'll see um, and uh, yeah the, the normals are going to be available as well I'm not keeping any I have a, a few visual um, albino females so um, I, I just too bad that the male didn't prove out but you know that's how it is but that's kind of the exciting part you know the the, the fun of it is when you're breeding and you're just excited to see what you know what you're going to hatch and if they prove out great if it don't you know it is what it is but um this is a I wonder if this is a yellow belly i don't know if the the butter or the albino is yellow belly but, but look at that belly it could just be the head it's affecting that right so for those of you guys that are yellow belly experts let me know i don't think that's yellow belly this one right here no uh, but hey could be right that's the GHIs so look at that so that what I notice is GHI single gene GHI when there is a hit it really changes the pattern I mean not pattern but uh, put some put some graniting on it um, I have another GHI, but it's HEP for hypo, and uh, it's definitely dirtier looking, or those all those graniting. Yeah, so I think these are both males. Let's double check. Yeah, that's a male. Yeah, that's a male. And I already checked the other one. I guarantee you now. So, all right, guys. I don't want to make the video too long. Uh, like the last one, it was like almost 20 minutes. So this one, hopefully you guys uh, enjoyed it. Uh, the update. Um, the next video will be um, all the videos, but I'll just uh, shoot another video post shed so everyone can see their their true colors. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for your support. Make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't. Um, you know, appreciate the support. Uh, that way you guys get notifications on new videos. I'm going to try to put up more videos um, uh, for the season. I, it's going to slow down. I have some females that are, that are either ovulated and did the, the post-ovulation shed, but I didn't catch it. Um, so I don't know if I did catch it or not. So we'll see. We'll just get a surprise um, uh, eggs in the next, uh, maybe next 30 days. So, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. Till next time.